Hey friend, I want to share something pretty personal with you and um, I posted it on Facebook a while ago and I think it helped a lot of people out but it's a picture of me when I was seven. Here it is, as you can see. And this picture is significant because it was my first Christmas that I ever had with my new parents. You see, I've shared this with a few people but I was adopted as a kid, physically abused, tortured, neglected. I remember times if I couldn't tie my shoes fast enough, my own father would put a cigarette out on my forehead. It's not the way any father should treat his son, or any parent for that matter. But I've learned a lot from this, and it's allowed me to help a lot more people. You know, it's through the trauma and the hardship and the bad experiences that you and I have that make us much more impactful much more passionate, much more compassionate, right? More love, more unconditional love, more understanding. So whatever you've been through, um, whatever you're going through, maybe this has been a tough week for you. I know it has been for me uh, recently with Facebook booting us off and you know, not allowing us to impact people on that platform as much as we were. Uh, it's upsetting, you know, and we can go off in our human ways and and get upset and pout, if we, if you want to call it that. Or we can remember where we came from. The struggles, the triumphs, the victories that we've had. The things that have made us who we are. So dig deep down in your soul, in your mind, and think about those things that have shape-shifted who you are, have made you this powerful being that is here to, to serve a distinct purpose. And the fact that you're breathing right now means that your purpose has not been fulfilled yet. So I believe you are here for great things. If you're watching this video, you've attracted this information into your life for a reason. And I'm grateful for you. Maybe we've never met, but I see you. I think you're an amazing human and I appreciate you. So as always, Enjoy the rest of the weekend. I'm gonna be shooting more of these personal videos for you guys. I'm just kind of chilling out, relaxing, doing a meditation by the pool. See where I am? And um, real quick and easy meditation I'll show you since I have you here is to take deep breaths. So you're gonna breathe in with me. Breathe out. Are you holding it? Do you feel it? Ready? Breathe in. Breathe out. This immediately grounds you. It lowers your cortisol, which is your stress hormone in your body. Now if we want, we can couple this, we can stack it with another uh, neurological process that I like to do, and that is just to simply look around like this. So you're still breathing, those deep breaths. And as you look around, look for something in the room or outside or wherever you are. And just kind of hold a gaze on it after you see something that's beautiful or just kind of sticks. And then breathe in and breathe out. You're gonna feel so much more relaxed. And if you feel your head nodding a little bit like this, that's no problem at all. That's just the Kundalini energy coming out of your body and it's a beautiful thing because that's going to put you in an even more of a relaxed state. So hopefully this video was helpful. I'm going to do more personal videos for you just like this. Leave a comment below if it was. I'm going to be personally reaching out and responding and um, I know what you're thinking. You're probably wondering what's on my shirt. So I'll show this to you real quick too. I bought this from the guys over at imaginary.com or something like that. Amazing website, lots of really cool stuff. And um, I love the sacred geometry in their work. The infinity sign, the man standing at the vortex of creation, the possibility that's in it. So if you're interested in that, I'll leave a link below this video as well. Anyway, I've rambled long enough. Remember, your struggles go forward today, make big things happen. Your purpose has not been fulfilled because you're still breathing and do this meditation with me. Talk to you soon.